One of the really important parts of an ecosystem and of any life cycle are decomposers. Decomposers are everywhere and they're essential for our wildlife um, and all habitats. Uh, I like to think of the decomposers as the FBI, fungi, bacteria, and invertebrates. And invertebrates are things that don't have backbones, so worms, roly-polies, spiders, things like that. They all have a very important role within the life cycle. They're going to decompose, breaking down dead things and turning it into soil. Right next to me is a tree that we can see that decomposition happening as it's turning into soil. New plants are growing in that soil from this rotting log. And those aren't the only living things that are out here. Let's turn this log over and see what we find. Ooh, there's new life. Oh, we've got some roly polies. Let's see if we can get them out there. They get called that because they roll up into little balls to hide or play dead. They're still down there foraging. There's a worm over here working through the soil. We can see on the log fungi, so mushrooms, uh, usually what we'll see are, we think of uh, the, the mushrooms that grow up out of the soil. However, they actually have uh, things that are living under the soil or in the rotting logs. So when we look here, we can see little strands of parts of our decomposers that are living here within our log. I don't see them, but I know there's got to be spiders and other things living in here that are eating this wood, feeding on the other insects that are living in here. A dead tree is full of life. So a life cycle, like, like it sounds, it's, it's a cycle. There, things happen. So animals are born, uh, they grow, they mature, they reproduce, they live on, they eventually die. Uh, when they die, we find evidence of them around. These bones are what's left after the decomposers. Uh, things like the bacteria and the invertebrates have eaten away the flesh, all the living tissue, and what's left behind is, is the bone. So we can find evidence of different animals that have lived out here. This may have been a, a raccoon that once lived out here. Uh, kind of a small jaw, it might be a young animal. Um, and we could potentially find evidence of what may have caused its death. We may not ever know, but that's just part of the life cycle. <laughs>